The grizzly bear is leaving the San Gabriel Mountains it coincides with the time my family, our lineage is coming off the mountain. It's all on the same timeline. You don't really realize what's missing until generations pass and then you look and you say, well, there, there's something different here. It's not working quite right. Same time, we've been disconnected from our natural environment, so we don't know how to interact with it. I would say we're in a period of revitalization, period of discovery, period of going deeper into who we are as a people. We work really close with the Forest Service and, and other agencies and different groups to support that revitalization. As we reconnect and reestablish our care and stewardship of the land and in, in the land that we're ancestrally from, you know, the, the bear has a place and a parallel to that too. Before the bear can exist again, we have to have a healthy mountain range. And that's again goes back to the advocacy that we do, the activist work that we do, is to protect this environment. If we're going to be a voice of advocacy for these mountains, we have to maintain the connection. The key is we have to stay connected and we have to be there and be visible. When the grizzly left, we left. Now we return, we've been back. Maybe the grizzly will return and be back as well.